From the Tennessee Valley Weather Channel, this is your weather tonight. Mostly clear to partly cloudy overnight. Temperatures dropping out of the 80s as we head into the overnight, getting down to mainly the lower 70s as we head toward daybreak. But you can see even in the morning hours of Saturday here after sunrise, we warm quickly out of the 70s through the 80s. And we'll be well up into the 90s, mid to upper 90s as we head into our Saturday afternoon. Some hot weather ahead here across the Tennessee Valley. Here's a breakdown with the future cast tonight. Partly cloudy to mostly clear skies out there. Future cast overdoing the cloud cover just a little bit, but it does fade away even on the future cast model. Lower 70s as we head toward daybreak. Warming quickly tomorrow. We'll be well up into the 90s during the afternoon. I think it's mid to mainly upper 90s. 10% chance of a stray thunder shower for our Saturday in the afternoon, just like the few that we've seen earlier today in one or two locations. Most of us staying dry, however, and then partly cloudy overnight, dropping back to the low to mid 70s for overnight lows Saturday night into Sunday morning. Partly cloudy once again with a 10% chance of a thunder shower for Sunday. More of the same for Monday. We tick up the rain chances slightly as we head into Tuesday, but it's Wednesday and Thursday when that frontal system to the north makes it in here that the rain chances really tick up a good bit. Here's the breakdown. We'll have a 10% chance of rain through the weekend and through Monday. We'll bump it up to 20% for Tuesday for a few more isolated afternoon and evening thunder showers. It's Wednesday and the Thursday and maybe stretching into Friday when the rain chances start to come up a bit as that frontal system moves into the area. And that also brings us some heat relief. We're upper 90s and lower 100s here from the weekend all the way through Wednesday. And these are not heat index values. These are afternoon air temperature daytime highs. Heat index values here likely to be 103 to 108 during this period, but then we start to relax the heat as we go into the latter part of the week as that frontal system gets in here and likely even upper 80s by Friday for daytime highs. And that may stick around on into next weekend and at least part of the week just beyond that as we get a trough of low pressure in the upper atmosphere, we kind of reverse the pattern. We've had a ridge here lately. That ridge shifts off to the east and we get troughing instead and that gives us a relaxation from the heat and it also increases rain chances. But we have to get to the latter part of next week before we see that pattern start to take shape. Mostly clear, partly cloudy overnight, getting down to the lower 70s for morning lows. And then a stray chance of a thunder shower in the afternoon, chances only 10%. So don't expect rain. Just don't be surprised if there is a pop-up shower near you. Daytime highs in the upper 90s. Upper 90s and lower 100s across the area from the weekend through Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Rain chances start to tick up beginning Tuesday in isolated fashion. Better chance of scattered showers and thunderstorms for the middle and end of next week. And toward the second half of next week, you also notice the temperatures trending down as well. There's a look at your latest seven-day forecast. Brian Wilson is in the Weather Center through the weekend with all your latest local weather.